Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of CNC Productions and today we're going to be doing another manhunt video in Jockey's Ridge, which you, which you can see across there. It's going to be the same thing, the person that's hiding is going to be the one that films running away from the hunter, whoever that may be. So. Well, that's only in an hour. Oh, are you serious? Yeah. What time is it? It's about 7. <laughs> But that's the best time to do these manhunt videos is at night. Because look at him go. Savages. We do, you know, challenges. <laughs> By the way, if you didn't notice the shirt, we got this. We got cool designs, which I design all myself. So if you guys want to see or buy some of these, Comment down below, and we'll make a... This wasn't here last time. No, it was all buried. This is part, there was a mini golf course that was right here, but the dunes came and, and, uh, and buried it. <laughs> That's sick. It was like frozen and hot. Okay. Right now, I am being hunted by Cameron. We did like a rock, paper, scissors thing, so. I was the first one to be hunted. Wow, so as soon as we get over this hill, oh gosh, this is a lot different than before. See, this, this landscape is always changing. You can see the sun, that's beautiful actually. So long, Cambo! There's the ocean and the sound. What's cool about this desert, or mini desert, is <clears throat> that it's the only dunes where you can see a sunrise and a sunset over the water. Not many, well actually this is the only one that, that is able to have that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to merge with these footsteps so he can't really see where I'm going. i got to move though because he's coming after me, so I'll catch you later. That area right there is the one I want to go to. It's called the Badlands, <laughs> and there's like, there's a lot of nooks to hide in. So hopefully he didn't get a clue. I'm sorry if I'm breathing heavy, man. I was running up that giant hill. <sighs> hopefully he doesn't get a clue on where I'm actually at, because this is, could end very badly for me. Okay, I made it down. I'm gonna go up here. There's a lot of footsteps around here. It's very quiet. No one's usually up here, which kind of stinks because it's better to go where there's a lot of people. Hmm. There's a crab. Right. And there's that dune there. I don't want to go around that because I think he's right there. But the bad thing is, if he comes through here, I'm toast because I only got one way in and out. Rules are he has to double hand tag me in order to catch me. So what I want to do is go through where all those people are watching the sunset. I just came out here to hide out for a little bit. I'm gonna go the long way around. Hopefully, I don't see him. Coast is clear, I gotta keep looking behind myself. Because he could be anywhere. My hair is so crazy. I was in the ocean swimming. I don't see him, so I gotta make a run for it. So I'm gonna shut this off so I don't have to make much. I thought, I thought this bank would save me, but he can really clearly see me if he walks over that ridge. I have had no sign of him, but I want to go up there. It seems like a long way away, but not too bad. Got to walk through this grass. You got to be careful of cactus and stuff like that. I don't know what kind of weird track that is. Huh. I'm obviously not the first one to be. Ow! What did I say, cactus? That's gonna leave a mark. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That hurts so freaking bad. Ah. 
it's gonna start bleeding. This was a bad idea. Yeah, I'm bleeding. Gotta watch for that. That really stung. It kind of feels like a wasp sting, but it only feels like a sting when it stings you. You know when you get stung by a wasp, you can like feel it after you get stung. It's kind of like, it feels like you just got stung, but the pain goes away kind of quickly, which is good. Okay. Oh my gosh, there he freaking is. He's going the wrong way. Gonna go, go, go. I gotta go. I'm in a pickle. He sees me. Yep. He really does see me. Oh gosh. Okay. My game plan, run over to that. I'm gonna go through this grass patch here. That's gonna hurt like heck. Oh, he's wait, he's going the other way now. Let's see him. Okay, give me a sec, guys. I think he saw me, I just don't think he's I think he's playing me a little bit. He really did see me. He keeps checking back. I'm almost positive he saw me. What's he doing? He's running behind that hill. I decided it might be a bad decision because he might know my He is really doesn't know I'm here. I'm gonna hope it's not. But you really can't be too sure. Now look at this. I've gotta go through all this grass. And if I just stepped in a cactus like that quickly, I don't know. I see a lot of footsteps here, so I'm assuming a lot of people have my same idea. Because I see bare footprints and shoes here. So I'm gonna go to where I see tracks. I don't know. This, all right, I'm just gonna cut straight through here. I keep stepping on sharp things, but they don't hurt. The grass here is more solid. I'm not leaving really big footprints. That's a good thing. When you go in a manhunt, like after a hurricane, it's very good because you can just you can just head straight through the uh, water, and he can't follow your tracks. It's like a dog. You always see in those old movies. You can't, you know, <laughs> a dog can't smell you in the water. Same with manhunt. You can't track in the water. Tracking is what's make this really difficult. Hopefully, I'm doing a good job. I'll get back to you if I see if there's any new improvements. My original plan was... Oh, freak, oh, freak. Oh, he stands still, he won't see me. He's right there. Look at that bossness. I'm doing this so I don't know if he looks at me. I'm just not moving because if I move I'm in his peripheral vision. Yeah, he saw me. He completely saw me. down there but he'd probably follow my footprints he definitely saw me I saw him side eyeing me obviously how could he not see me but I'm gonna do this kind of where I go back and follow his footprints then kind of follow him no. oh crap <laughs> you fell Something I see. 
I've got a cactus in my hand. Oh, freak. Go follow me through that. I got away from him though, because he fell. Okay, over this hill. Come on, run a little bit. I don't think I did, but I really think I got away from him. I should have followed my instinct. I was going to go retrace his steps. Didn't I tell you guys that? Should have done that. I'm leaving massive footprints because this sand is very soft. Everyone's leaving. That's not a good sign for me. I think I really did get away from them. There's gonna be some park rangers coming up here. Close the park. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna camp. And if he finds me, he finds me. It's a lot of burrs here though. Yeah, right in here. If I do, though, I could make a quick escape through there. Well, let's just leave it at this. Seems like he's talking on the phone up there. Who is he talking on the phone with? There's no other way I could have gone. <laughs> I can still run and make you exhausted for whenever I catch you in the... Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I can make you exhausted for what I want to do! <laughs> Alright, you got me. <laughs> Can't be out here all night. Hope you guys enjoyed that episode of CNC Productions. Uh, if you did, then leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. He got sand. Once I get sand out of my eye. He got sand in his eye, so that's why he's not gonna be. He's not gonna be the hunted for this. <laughs> but there's always next month. <laughs> so, see you guys later. What's up with the creepy Halloween music?